DR owners love to share their stories with us, and we love to hear them. Chris Diaz and his wife Verena own and manage an equestrian facility in Colorado. They have years of experience maintaining professional riding arenas, and the DR Power Grader proved to be the best solution. As the uh, owner of an equestrian facility, one of the main things that we worry about is having good, consistent footing. I've tried a lot of different uh, types of arena drags and groomers and uh, have definitely learned that they are not all created the same. I've tried things as simple as chain harrows and dragging those around. Uh, those are good for taking care of the top layer of the footing, but they don't do a very good job of actually moving the footing around and redistributing it evenly, so you tend to get waves, you get high spots and low spots. Uh, one of the things that I really like about the, the DR grader is that it has a pivoting front uh, yoke, and so as it goes, regardless of the ATV hits a high spot or a low spot, uh, the, the drag or the grader behind it uh, stays very consistent, and it seems to do a really nice job. It's pretty important for the horse to have that consistent footing, and so what you want, the whole purpose of grading and, and dragging the arena is to make it consistent all the way across the arena. And then once we've got it just a little bit tracked out, then we'll come in here and we'll, uh, we'll use the grader. Okay, so now we're going to demonstrate the grader uh, remote control mechanism and how it raises and lowers the grader so that you can control the depth. I don't want to have those scarifying teeth biting into my uh, base, so I'm just going to position it to where they're barely touching at all. And what that's going to do is give the effect, effect of uh, kind of fluffing up and just kind of uh, loosening up that top layer of footing, but not digging into the base layer. Okay, so the next thing I want to show is specifically uh, the working along the edge of the rail. So I've had Sarah pull up, and you can see she's really uh, kind of hugging the edge of this kick rail, and the design works quite well because it's got a flat edge, so I don't have to worry about it scraping or tearing up the kick rail. Uh, but you'll notice here that it is pulling material away and it's kind of collecting uh, along this edge. That's great. Uh, that's exactly what we want. It's pulling the material away from the edge, redistributing it back into the center. It basically just falls, uh, falls downhill and uh, becomes more level. Very nice feature. Um, without that, you really have to spend a lot of time with a, a rake or a shovel or a hoe or manually trying to pull that material away. Really like that. We've been using it for about a year, year and a half now. Very happy with the results and uh, working with the DR team. Uh, very happy. Can only recommend it. Thanks.